of the AFL's brightest stars, Bailey Smith, has confessed to using illicit drugs after damning photos and a video emerged today. For now, the Western Bulldogs club has thrown its full support behind the 21-year-old, conceding he's been battling mental health demons. One of the VFL's brightest stars, Rupert Putnam, has confessed to taking illegal drugs today after damning microfilm likenesses emerged of Putnam at an opium den. For now, the Geelong Pivotonians Football Club has got behind their beleaguered star, conceding he has been battling diphtheria. Outraged today as one of footy's brightest stars, Dermot Brereton, has confessed to drinking a light beer after a game. The Hawks are behind their star player for now, but have said if it happens again, he will be delisted. Our agenda tonight begins with Melbourne. It is a crossroads moment in a premiership defence. The Demons have chosen to put their culture ahead of their immediate needs and suspend Stephen May from the Queen's birthday blockbuster. He flagrantly broke the drinking protocols in a concussion scenario and then he fought with a teammate in public. It's a crossroad moment for the Premiership defence. The Fuchsias have chosen to put club culture ahead of their immediate needs and suspend Hugh Dunbar from the King's birthday blockbuster this Monday. He flagrantly broke dress protocols in a dinner setting and wore an ascot tie to the Kelvin Club. The Essendon Football Club has reportedly admitted some of its players took a now-banned performance-enhancing drug. Outraged today as the Essendon Football Club admitted that some of its players have been smoking menthol cigarettes. Essendon Football Club have admitted to using now banned horse leeches when treating their players with injury. Club officials claim they were led to believe the leeches were legal under the Anti-Doping Act. Doctors have apologised and will go back to their traditional ways of treating knee injuries using exorcisms. Good evening. We begin with the dramatic news in the AFL, which has been rocked by a betting scandal with two Collingwood players. Defender Heath Shaw has been suspended for a total of 14 weeks and fined $20,000 for betting $10 on Nick Maxwell to kick the first goal in their Round 9 match against Adelaide. Good evening. We begin with the dramatic news that the VFL has been rocked by a betting scandal. Defender Clyde Donaldson will miss 14 weeks for missing his gambling debts to Squizzy Taylor, who has since broken Donaldson's thumbs. <laughs> 